Hi, it's uh, Nick from Digital Yacht with an update today and a detailed look at our new 4G Extreme internet access solution. So this uses cellular connectivity for internet access afloat up to about 25 miles offshore thanks to its latest MIMO technology. Now it sits alongside our current 4G Connect product uh, but offers a few unique features and functions and gives you premium internet access connectivity thanks to its super fast 700 megahertz A7 processor and a four times size improvement of RAM, 256 megabytes of RAM built into the product for super fast connectivity up to 300 megabits a second. It even supports up to 150 concurrent connections so everybody on board the boat can have connectivity. So let's take a look. So this is the product, this is 4G Extreme. Uh, you'll see that it has two antennas here. They're the two internal Wi-Fi antennas. And a key part of the functionality on 4G Extreme is that it creates a Wi-Fi network on board your boat. It actually creates two separate Wi-Fi networks, a 2.4 gigahertz and a 5 gigahertz network, which can be used independently. Also, uh, there's two external antenna connections on the product for connection to the uh, dual external antennas that are supplied. The external antennas are like this. So they're uh, approximately 18 inches long and supplied with a substantial deck base and cabling ready to connect direct to the modem. And you'll need two to get the system to operate correctly. That's because it uses MIMO technology, which effectively uses dual antennas, dual receivers, dual transmitters inside the unit to get you speed and range. Now also on the unit is connectivity for wired devices. So you'll see here on the N panel, uh, regular network ports, uh, RJ45 network ports. There's three LAN ports and also a WAN port which can be connected to another internet source. You may have satellite or a LAN-based internet solution or even a uh, high-power Wi-Fi like our WL510. That can connect to the WAN port and you can then effectively share the internet connection and the 4G Extreme will switch between the two. You'll also notice that there's dual SIM slots on the unit. Two SIMs can be inserted into the unit and you can switch between the two. So you could have a SIM from Vodafone and a SIM from EE and switch between the two depending on which is giving you the best performance. The unit will also auto fail over uh, to another one if one of the uh, first providers fails. So really useful feature and function there. The status lights are showing the Wi-Fi and connectivity status, which is useful. And perhaps most importantly, there's an NMEA 2000 interface. So 4G Extreme will plug straight into your NMEA 2000 navigation and instrumentation backbone on the boat and all that data will be available on the Wi-Fi network for uh, apps and so on to use on mobile devices like phones, tablets, PCs and Macs. So you can take advantage of all the modern apps like Navionics, iNavX, Navlink and so on and get that data into your mobile device. Now also built into 4G Extreme is uh, a GPS, which is really useful for tracking applications. So it ships with a very neat uh, small GPS antenna, which can be just hidden below deck on a fiberglass boat uh, and allows for you to have a, an internal GPS for tracking. So you can arrange for the unit to send you SMS messages if the boat moves outside a predefined uh, zone. And this will also be used for Internet of Things type applications as well. Finally, there's Bluetooth built in. So it ships with a small Bluetooth antenna. This is for future applications. Uh, there'll be lots of low power Bluetooth sensors coming on, which you'll be able to integrate into the system. In terms of accessories, uh, 4G uh, Extreme ships with two seven meter cables. These are specialist coax cables using uh, a cable called LMR200. There's also 10 meter and 20 meter options available. Uh, these use the thicker LMR400 type cable. Uh, there's also antenna adapters to connect the standard uh, 1.25 inch uh, fittings that are supplied with the antennas as standard to regular one inch fittings on board the boat. Full details of that and all this on our website at www.digitalyacht.co.uk. Thanks very much for listening.